Hi everyone, uh, so this is actually the first video on Excel Visual Basics for Application tutorial. So the first thing we will try and achieve is how to create a simple macro using Excel Visual Basics. So um, you can see this Excel sheet open up right here. You would just need to go in the developers tab you need to go on Visual Basic. Alternatively, you can press Alt F11. Once you're on this page, you can um, go in Modules. You can select Insert, and you can add a module. So um, you could have pretty much done this if there were no modules as well. So, for example. In the start, you'll only be able to see these four things. Um, depending how many other sheets you have, you could have just clicked on any of this, select insert, and click on module. This would automatically add a new module to your existing VBA. So, um, to write a first macro, we can use something like um, so to start off with the sub procedure, you need to write sub and the name of that sub. So, let's say a sub hello world and you just hit enter and it will automatically prepare an endpoint to this sub now um, to refer to a cell on visual basics you need to refer to the row and the column so for example this is the first column it's referred alphabetically so as you can see the first column is A similarly this is the first row you can refer to it numerically which is the first row. So for example, if I had to paste some data, I would write range A, which is my column, 1, which is my row, the value is equal to hello world. And finally, I can click on run sub. As you can see right here, we've managed to write our first macro using Visual Basics for applications. So many such more videos to come up guys please stay tuned and hope to see you soon